Hello and welcome to this Kmart haul. Today I'm going to be showing you the best things to buy in Kmart that are travel related. For those of you new here, my name is Brie and I'm a flight attendant, so I've got your back when it comes to travel items. I know exactly what you need. So I hope this video is really helpful for you. I did a bit of online shopping and I bought some things. So I'm excited to share these with you today. Just a disclaimer, Kmart in Australia is very different to Kmart in other countries. So if you're from a different country, I'll be linking some Amazon on links down below where you can buy these items. Cool, let's open the box. What are you doing here? I'm introducing today's sponsor. All right, come on over. Today's sponsor is Udi. Udi is a wearable blanket that you can wear and it feels like a cloud. Um, it's the comfiest thing ever. If you want one of these, you can use my discount code BriannaY30 and get $30 off one of these. Are you done yet? <laughs> yeah, I'm done now. <laughs> right. Now we've gotten rid of her, let's get into opening the box. Wowee. <laughs> yeah, there's lots of things in here. The first item is a portable blender. So this will be fantastic for traveling and I literally cannot wait to use it. I've been wanting to get one of these for ages. It's really pretty as well, that's gorgeous. It is USB charged. There's USBs on a plane, so I could even charge this on the plane, which is great. There is a little blade and there's also a little cup. So you can just pop in what you want and there's a button at the back here where you can press, turn it on and it'll start blending. It was only $19. So yeah, I think that is a great little travel item because to be honest, whenever I'm traveling, I always crave fresh fruit and fresh vegetables. And also I always love to work out or go for runs on my layovers and when I'm traveling. So this would be a great way to have a little protein shake. Pop some protein in there and swivel it up. It holds a max of 300 mils and it's BPA free. So that's always good as well. The next item are these itonomizers. Basically what it is, is it's a little perfume bottle. So you can put your perfumes in here. We all know how expensive perfume is, so you don't want to be lugging that around with you as you're traveling. So it's good to have a little spritz and plus this is a very good little size. You can just pop it into your purse or pop it into your suitcase. And what you actually do is you put your own perfume me here and then you can just put it together and you know do a little spritz which is amazing they were four dollars for these two so super cheap <laughs> the next thing that I have is a rose hip oil I'm obsessed with rose hip oil but I've never used a facial mist rose hip oil before so oh it smells really good these are really good because when you're traveling on the aircrafts, the air is very, very dry. So I'm excited to use this and just spritz on my face. These mists are really good because unlike a lotion, you don't actually have to rub it into your face. You can just spray it. So if you are a flight attendant or if you are traveling and you're wearing makeup, you can just spray this over your makeup and it keeps your face looking really fresh. Plus it also says that it is brightening and firming. So that's always good. The next thing that I have is this neck roll memory phone with a hood. <laughs> I kind of got this as a bit of a joke because it looked really funny on the website, but it is a normal like travel neck pillow, but it comes with a hood. Isn't that just so comfy? This would be really good because when you're in an aircraft, sometimes you just want to like hide away and just shield your face from any light, especially if you're trying to sleep. Plus it's like, Super comfy. That was my hair. It's memory foam, so it's really good quality and it's really soft and squishy. It has a little zip as well, so you can pull this off and then just wash this if it gets dirty or anything like that. So, so I thought that was a travel must have. I'm really excited to wear this on an aircraft. The next thing that I got is this weighted jump rope. Not only is it really cute with these pink handles, but skipping ropes are an amazing tool to take with you when you're traveling. They're light and they're also really compact. So if you wanna get your cardio up and you don't have a treadmill or you can't go for a run because of you know, security reasons or anything like that, or the gym's closed <laughs> because of COVID. Or if you have to quarantine in your hotel room like I do all the time, this is gonna come in handy because I love doing exercise on my layovers. So yeah, I'm really excited to use this. Plus we all know how good skipping is for your heart and for your cardio and you know, for your overall health. So yeah, I'm really excited to use this and I would definitely recommend it if you're wanting to go traveling and you like exercising. The next thing I got was this silk, blend basically this is a little pack Ooh. 
and it comes with a silk scrunchie, which feels amazing by the way. And it also comes with this little sleeping mask. So this is really good because if you're on an aircraft and you want to sleep, you can wear this. If you're a flight attendant and you're working back the clock or something like that, pop this on your eyes and you'll be able to sleep during the day. And if light is coming in, you'll be able to, um, you know, shield that out. Plus it feels really luxurious. I'm actually really surprised at this quality. Um, and this was a really affordable price as well. It was $15 and it comes with a little travel pouch as well. So you can pop those two things in and keep them nice and safe. Plus, if you didn't know, scrunchie, silk scrunchies are actually really good for your hair. If you wear them, especially at night, they don't break your hair because they're silk. And they also don't leave like a kink in your hair as well. So sometimes when you wear like a ponytail with an elastic and then you take it out and there's a kink, this doesn't do that. So I thought this was the perfect little travel Thing. So I definitely recommend purchasing this. And the next thing I got were these two little containers. Um, I think these would be amazing for traveling because they're stainless steel. So they would keep things really secure. And also this little lid, I feel like would keep things on really well. Like that's not gonna come off and it'll be really easy to wash. It's really little, so you can just like pop it in your suitcase. Um, you could do lots of things with this. You could put moisturizers in here if you want. You could even put salad dressings in here if you want to take it to work or anything like that. So yeah, I just think little containers are great for traveling. You can use them for so many different things. They were $1.50 each, bargain. So the next thing I got was this little jewelry box. This is amazing because the worst thing that you want is your jewelry to get broken or anything like that. So it has these little compartments where you can put jewelry in, you can put some rings in here. It also has a little mirror so it can keep your jewelry you know, nice and secure, which is really great. I'm definitely gonna be using this because to be honest, what I've been using for my jewelry right now is just a little pouch. And I'm very concerned that my jewelry can get squished and things like that. So this can keep it not squished, so that's great. This was $8, so really affordable. Great quality as well, and it's pink. Beautiful, love it. While we're talking about jewelry, this is off topic. It's not really travel related, but I got some jewelry from Kmart um, and I wanna share them with you. So the first thing that I got was this snake necklace. I thought this was really beautiful and it was $2. Can you believe it? What a bargain. Beautiful, beautiful necklace, love it. The next thing that I got were these hoops. This was $4 for three hoops. These ones look like the ones that I currently am wearing, which I think are really cool. And I love these ones here. And yeah, I'm excited about that. And then these ones as well, they were $4. These are an exact dupe of a Masoma earring that I've seen. These actually would be really good for traveling because if you're worried about losing your jewelry or going in water with your jewelry or anything like that, if you're just buying something quite cheap and you wear it on holiday, then you don't have to worry about it getting damaged or anything like that. Yeah, these might actually be a good thing for traveling as well. And I find that um, little pieces of jewelry like this really elevate an outfit, especially if you're traveling. So I always bring jewelry with me when I'm traveling. The next thing that I got is this candle set. This is actually would be a really good gift set for anyone wanting to give someone a gift. I don't know about you, but I love candles. I like have them on every day and things like that. And these are really little as well. So you could even like chuck them in your suitcase. If, if you're traveling to relax, take a little candle with you and just light it up in your hotel room, put a face mask on. Mmm, smells so good. And they have these little um, names on them. So this one says dream, this one says focus, boost, revive, this one said relax. Um, so yeah, these would be a fantastic little travel candle to take with you because they're so little. Smell delicious and you have lots of different ones to pick from. These were $7.50 for all of these candles. So literally like a dollar each, not even, so. The next thing I have is lavender oil. If you didn't know, I've actually been using lavender oil literally for years. Um, I swear by it and I think it works a treat for sleep. So if you are someone who struggles with sleep or if you're traveling within different time zones and you need to be knocked out like that, <laughs> use lavender oil. Drop a few drops on your pillow. I always put it on my wrists as well and it just knocks me out. Let me see what this one smells like. 
Mmm, that's really nice. To be honest, I've never used this lavender oil before. I used quite an expensive one, but this was $3.25. So <laughs> if you're wanting to just try out lavender oil, give it a go. It's so cheap. Why not? The next item are these silicon food bags. These would be really good for traveling because they're flat. Unlike a big bulky container, you'll be able to put some food in here, seal it up and just be on your way. These can be put into the dishwasher as well. So saves you time. I'd be wanting to try them for a very long time. The next item is this collapsible travel cup. So I'm really excited about this one because it actually collapses. There's like a normal keep cup. Um, and what you do is you can pull it off and then you can just collapse it like that which is fantastic because I don't know about you but keep cups and stuff like that they take up so much room and this little thing just pops in there like that very sleek very compact great for traveling if you travel you need your coffee in the morning get one of these this is like fantastic plus I think this is like a really cute color as well <laughs> yeah I'm very excited to try this with my hot chockies. Um, and the last item I got isn't travel related. Well, I don't know, it could be, but they are artificial nails. And these were $4 each. So that is very, very cheap. I chose some nudes because I, I can only wear nudes or red to work. Instead of spending $40 on like a manicure, spend $4, you know, save yourself some money. Also, sometimes when you're traveling, you chip a nail or you can't make it to a salon. These are great to just you know, take with you. So there is my travel haul from Kmart. I really hope that you enjoyed this video. I'll be putting all the links for these items down in the description. And I'll also put a similar item from Amazon that you can get. I really hope that you enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching. Make sure you do the things, like, subscribe, and yeah, I'll talk to you guys later.